hello everybody so i'm actually uploading and rendering my massive monster x and wano photo card sorting and storing video uh, when this little package arrived unexpectedly today um and let me tell you it was a rough day so it's nice to have something to distract me from the very stressful day i had today Long story short, involved work and the IRS. So, so this came from DHL, from K Town for You, and it is currently about nine o'clock at night, and there is no lighting outside naturally. So I'm using overhead lighting. So again, there's going to be unfortunately some shadow, but I wanted to do this unboxing because, like I said, I needed a nice distraction. I've ordered a few things from K-Town for you, so I didn't know what this was at first until I looked at the label that's on the other side, and now I know what it is. So without further ado, K-Town for you. Ooh. I'm excited because I have not seen an unboxing of this album yet. So this will be new and exciting for me as well. What we have here is NCT Dream's first full album. And they're back to OT7. Mark is back, so this is so exciting. This is my first NCT Dream album ever. I actually haven't really collected anything from NCT until Resonance, so I collected the Resonance Part 1 and Part 2. Um, and I really wanted to get NCT Dream because Jamin and Jeno are a couple of my alt biases, and I had to support the boys. So before we get into the albums, let's look at, I guess, these posters that came with K-Town for you. And this might be a disaster because SM posters are pretty big. And here's one poster. There they all are. Oh, dashing. And here is poster two. It's like SM knows that these two have like a gravitational pull towards each other and these two. And here's the poster number two. Looks like some pizza and some snacks. Oh, corn chips. Yum. And here's the last poster. Oh, we got Jeno front and center. And those were the three posters and here are the three versions of the album i guess the photo book versions i think there's also a jewel case version but i'm not very big on jewel cases so this is what i picked i'm not sure what version is what i guess i should have researched that more fail Oh, let's do it like a traffic light. Let's go red, yellow, green. But here is the front of the album. It almost looks like a like a collage of some sort. Here's the side. It's in red. And here's the back, similar to the front. And I think this album slides out. Yep, so I'm gonna pull the inclusions out and let's get to the photo book. Okay, I think I got all the random inclusions out, but there's also other 
things here. This looks to be... Oh, that's nice. It's like a handwritten thank you mini poster. Oh, that's very nice. And also you get... Oh, another mini poster. Oh, is this a random? Oh, this must be a random. Maybe it's a, okay, well, surprise. This appears to be Chenla, is it Chenla? I always say his name that way, Chenla? Chenla, I can't pronounce his name, but that's Chenla, Chenla. And you get some stickers. Got a pizza, a football, and then other random things. And this is a photo book. <laughs> it's, I like it. Hot Sauce, which is their first full length album. As far as tracks go, um, I literally love every single track. Hot Sauce and Diggity are like faster tracks, but there's a lot of very slow tracks, and I actually like slow tracks. Um, I'm not quite sure how to pronounce number seven. My dirty mind goes to something else. Um, but other than that, it's a great album. Like, it's a great first album. No skips, every song. So let's go into this photo book. Oh, okay, it folds out. It's a very trippy, multicolored photo book. It looks like we start with Geno. Oh, Chenga. Jimin. Got little Hei Chan there and Ji Sung. Ren Jun. I love this. <sighs> this hair is like everything. I love this hair on Ren Jun. And there's Mark. Wow, it's a very bright and colorful photo book already. The Dreamies. I know they're all stepping into adulthood, but. They're still the dreamies, you know. Still childlike and innocent in a way. And very playful. This looks like a very fun photo shoot. <laughs> It's almost like an acid trip, to tell you the truth. Hey, Chan. Wait, who? Is that? Is that Jenna again? Oh no, that's Hey, Chan. That, ugh, duh. Okay, sorry, everybody. Renjun. This is a very fun photo book. It's just very, it's, it's unlike any other photo book I've seen so far from any other group that I've collected. Are his pants ripped? Yeah, they're completely ripped. So what did you guys think of the hot sauce music video? I actually personally loved it. I was not expecting that drop that, I guess, you know, that, that drop and that kind of, I don't know, that sound. 
I wasn't expecting that at all as far as part of the chorus anyway. Wow, Jeno looks amazing. Good lord. I know some people are funny about seeing their underwear line, um, but I'm not. I am here for it. Jamin. God, so handsome. I hope I pull Jeno and Jamin because it is a nightmare collecting them because they are expensive members to collect. And those of you who collect those photo cards, you know what I mean. I love his outfit. I love the outfits in this. They're just so random. It's almost like thrift store out outfits, but I know they're not. These are probably more expensive than like what I make in a year. They're wearing a lot of Celine, I've noticed. I have heard of that brand. Let me get some group shots. <laughs> so Jisung, cute. I love this hair on Jeno. Wow, I just really love this photo book. I'm definitely glad this is part of my collection because it's such a colorful and interesting photo book and it's just got so many things going on oh now we're back to the track list <laughs> it's funny it's like um the ingredient labels on the back of a can or on the back of any i guess product that's funny again this, oh, all night long. Okay. Okay. I don't know why I didn't put two and two together when I listened to the song. But more than likely, I was indulging in some wine as usual. So, it's probably, it probably took me a while to get the two. And looks like the CD is back here. Oh. Look at this CD. Cute. It's like a, a tomato or something. Wow. Great, great photo book. And we should be congratulating our dreamies because they are million sellers. Actually, they almost sold 2 million in pre-orders alone, which is, I believe, a record for SM. Which is insane when you think about it when they have artists like EXO, Girls Generation, TVXQ, Shiny. Like, it's just crazy. But the Dreamies, they did it. This looks to be like a. Oh, it's like a. Um, it's like a f postcard kind of book. You can never have too many pictures of the dreamies, so that's cool. Jamin. Chenla. I don't know why I say his name like that, but Chenla. Jisung, Mark, and Renjun. Cheno again. Look at Hei-chan. <laughs> Jamie. Oh, and the backs of them are just the same as the front, just in this red type of color. Very nice. This is, what is this? Oh, this isn't a random thing. This is that 
whatever lysm thing you get in all the albums for sm i guess advertising and all that stuff all right photo cards let's see looks like you get two i got uh oh hey chan cute i don't collect hey chan but he is very popular, so I know I can probably trade him. And... Oh! Ah! We got a J-Man! Oh! Oh, I'm so happy. Look at this hair. Oh, okay. That's excellent. Excellent, excellent. So, I guess for random things, we got the Chen Le poster. Hey Chan and Jamin photo cards. Very good start. All right, next we're gonna go to the yellow spine book. All right, here's the front. Very similar to the last album. I think they're just wearing different outfits. Yep. This jacket with a fringe reminds me of the one Sung Hoon from in hypen wears on their very first mini album i guess fringe is like in right now and this like flower suit oh, chef's kiss but there's the side and here's the back again lots of collage style photos going on okay let's get out the random things all right, so the stickers are different in this one. Get a watermelon, it looks like, and some other things. Looks like the thank you poster is... Oh, wow, the thank you poster is different. Look. Oh, it matches the concept. I wonder if the words are different. No, okay. So the background images are different, but... The thanks are the same. Thank goodness, I couldn't imagine them writing three sets of thank you notes. <laughs> yep, there's the back. All right, let's look at the photo book first. It's just like the first one, it's very holographic. So this one is definitely yellow. All right, let's look at the stuff in here. Oh, nice. Looks like we're gonna get some outdoor action on this one. And Jisung opening up strong. There's a lot of eye closing here. Hold on. Mark's eyes are closed. Jamin's eyes are closed. HN eyes are closed. I'll tell you, fringe is in. I guess they're wearing like the same jacket. Mm. Oh, you had to turn the can around. Although it looks like it's like a Mountain Dew or something, maybe? Hmm. Okay, it's a different jacket, but very similar. G Sung and Jeno. Oh, okay. It's that little motel setup. I saw a lot of teasers for that. Oh, it is a Mountain Dew. <laughs> I love this suit. Jamin has such good style. Or the stylist is just... I don't know, they treat him really good. I'd like to think that they had some input on their outfits, though.
I feel like Jeno loves this pose. I think I see a lot of the hand over his face type of posing with him. I could be wrong, but I think it's accurate. Let me know. I'm sorry. Well, sorry everybody. My uh, camera flash that I use when the lighting is bad in my room suddenly decided that my phone was too hot. So now the lighting will be really crappy and I'm sorry. But we need to power through this. So hopefully it's not too bad. And you can still see Jeno's beautiful face here. Yeah, I think it'll be okay. We'll see in editing if I can fix the lighting somehow. Now look at Jamin doing the Geno pose. Jisung is just smiling away, isn't he? Actually, I think the lighting is not as bad this way because there's no harsh glare from the camera flash but I really do need to invest in a ring light one day Jisung showing off some arm It's like he's standing on the top of a trailer roof or something. I love the volume of his hair. I don't know why. I was kind of hoping there'd be more, oh, group, I was about to say group shots or group interaction. And we're back to the song lyrics and track list and of course, producer list. So y'all tell me what's your favorite song on this album? I mean, I can't really pick a favorite one. Like I said earlier, they're all really good. And I was surprised how many, I guess, like slow ballad type songs there are when like the title song was so not a ballad. But then I thought of like EXO albums where like their main track is like some kind of like thumping song and then the rest of it's like very R&B heavy. So I guess it makes sense, SM is like that. This one has like little hot sauce bottles on it. Okay, then let's look at the little like postcard book thing. Oh, Mark's doing it too. Must be like a favorite pose of theirs. And the backs again are just the same picture, but this time in yellow. So we won't dwell on that too much. I wonder if they got a sponsorship for this Mountain Dew. Maybe Jeno and Hey Chan. These pictures look very similar, but I guess you can get but so many different shots of the same concept. Oh, look at those necklaces. He's blinging. Look at that, blinging. Ren June. <laughs> oh, I'll tell you something about Jeno, man. I always try to pick who I like better between Jeno and Jamin, and 
it's really hard to pick, but I think Geno slightly ahead of Jamin as far as my main ultimate bias of this group. Chandra. Alright, there's the back. Alright, let's see who we got for our random poster. Oh, we got Hei Chan. Looks like Hei Chan is blessing me today. First a photo card, now the random poster. Alright, photo card time. Oh, we got Mark. Oh, and oh, Chen La. Okay, I don't collect these two, so they'll be up for trade or sale. This album. We got Mark Yuck and Chen La. I'm trying to make this video shorter since my Monster X and Wano photo card storing video. It's like an hour and a half long, so... Anyway, here's the green... ...version. All right, let's get this out of the packaging. Wow, well, I'm so stupid. As I was... I guess you can't see it, but I kind of scratched Ren Jun's face a little bit with my... So, yeah. Anyway, here's the front cover. Same collage-type theme. Just different outfits. Let's get out the random inclusions. All right, the stickers are in green themed mostly for this one. Duh. And here is the thank you poster. Again, it's a different scene from the other two. the last photo book following the holographic theme. Let's look at the front flap group photo. Oh, it's the same as the thank you photo. All right, let's see what this photo book offers. Oh, Jamin. <laughs> Renjun, what are you doing? I'm just hanging out. Oh. Okay, he must be in some sort of loft area. Random. G Song. I love this checkerboard sweater, sweatshirt thing. No, it's like a sweater, it's like a pullover, I love it. Hey Chan. It's like they look like they were hung over or something. <laughs> Just having a chill hangover day. Been there, done that, right folks? Me too, me too. And munching down on food too. Love hangover food. And him with a flower pot on his head. Not sure why. Or at least this one gives us the little more group interactions that I was talking about on that second photo book. Mark. I swear this guy has not aged. He's looked the same since like, he debuted in NCT and NCT Dream. Like, good genetics there. Like, Ji Song, he's definitely blossomed. So has Shen La. Ren Jun too. But some of these folks, they look very similar. Like, I don't know, Jeno hasn't changed much either. He's had that same type of majestic, beautiful face since the beginning. Is that an Xbox? Yeah, it's an Xbox controller.
this is a cool photo book. It's definitely just them chilling, hanging out, relaxing. Fritos. Um, it's very like, you know, hanging out the college dorm with your buddies, you know. And then Hey Chan. <laughs> Man, that pizza looks good. I'm just so hungry right now. There's just a lot. I just noticed in all these books, there's a lot of product placement. Go die, huh? I wonder if they're being sponsored by some of these things. Like Xbox and Uno, Mountain Dew. And if they're not sponsored, they need to be. Because there's two million of these albums floating out there and look at all the free advertising they're getting. All right, now we are in our track list again. I'm curious what this CD is gonna look like. All right, it's green. What is that, four leaf clover, maybe? I can't quite tell. Hmm. And then, Here's the postcard book. <laughs> they look so like bored in this one. So like apathetic. They're just like, okay. Maybe this was like the last photo shoot and they're just like done for the day. I can't imagine how many photos they have to take for albums. Same Hey Chan, same. It's just, it's like they just hate life right now. And he's always putting stuff on his head. He's just running out of ideas, maybe. <laughs> oh, these boys, I tell you. Here is the random member mini poster. We got... <gasps> oh, we got Jeno. Oh, I'm keeping this. Darn tootin' I am. Oh, an Eagles record, good taste. It's a classic. I wonder if he even knows who the Eagles are. All right, and for our photo cards, we've got... Oh, we got Hey chan is this a dupe? Oh, we got our first dupe. Two Hey chans And... Oh, another Jamin. Oh, Jamin has blessed me today. So no Jeno, but that's okay. All right, and that was my unboxing and flip through of NCT Dream's first full-length album with all seven members as well. Hot Sauce. Um, overall, I love every photo book. I love just the concepts. I just love this whole collage style. Um, it was just, it was great packaging. The inclusions were really cool as well. I'm happy with my pulls, um, even though I only got to Jamin's um, and no Geno. At least the members I pulled are popular to my knowledge. I mean, Hey Chan is very popular and I think Mark is as well. Chunla, um, it's Chunla. He's so cute and adorable. I don't care if he's popular or not. Um, but yeah, so this was my unboxing of their latest album. And lo and behold, it's another insert clip. So it's taken me a while to edit and post my Monster X and Wano photo card storing video because I keep getting random copyright claims even though the software I use to edit provides the free music supposedly so I've had to like repost it three times and it takes forever to change the music then re-render then re-upload 
I've had to do it a couple of times because it kept copywriting me, which is strange, but I think I may have gotten it right this time. I'm about to post it again. But in the meantime, my second set of NCT Dream Hot Sauce albums came, this time from K-Town For You. And I haven't had a chance to edit my earlier video, the one from Weverse. So I thought I would just do a quick little insert of my K-Town For You set and see the photo card pulls. So without further ado, ch -ch -ch. all right, and remember, we are trying to manifest Jeno and Jamin because those are my two biases. So let's manifest some Nomen action. Please, 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 please. And I don't think you got anything really cool extra from K-Town for you. It was at this moment that he knew. He up. Wait a minute. Actually, <laughs> I'm such a goon. Um, my first set of albums was also from K-Town for you. Now that I remember, it wasn't from Weverse because <laughs> as NCT Dream is not a H-Y-B-E big hit label group. So, oops. Um, yeah, my first set was from K-Town for you, and it came with posters. The second set, I told them not to give me posters, so that's why there's no posters. Those were the special things you got, were the posters. But again, here's the NCT Dream Hot Sauce set. And since I went through the three albums in my first video, and again, sorry, I was so subdued on that first video. It was just a very depressing day. Um, I'm over it now, looking on the bright side, so I'll be a little more cheerful on this one unless we don't get any Geno or Demon. And we're going to go in the same order. Okay, let's make this quick since we already went through it. Alright, they are all out, so let's see who we got for our member poster. Oh, it's Chenla. Chenla? We got him on the first go around, so that's a dupe. Uh, we're not off to a good start. We got, oh, oh my god, Jeno, look how cute he is, oh, oh gosh, so happy, oh, so happy, so Jeno, okay, and, oh, oh, so obsessed with me. Jeno is just so obsessed. Look, I just hit the holy grail. I hit the holy grail. Look at the double dose of Jeno. Look at dark hair Jeno and blonde Jeno. Oh, amazing start. This is no matter what, who else I pull, I'm happy. I'm just happy. All right, yellow version again. How about that first? Pull though, everybody. Talk about manifesting your destiny. I need to start doing that more often. Let's get out these random inclusions. Okay, they're under this thing. Let's see who we got for random member poster. Oh, Ji Sungi. It's Ji Sung. Cute. And photo cards. Oh, Jamin. Yay, I pulled two Jamins first go around. And I don't think this was one of them. Hopefully not. Let me double check, hold on. And I was right. These were the two Jamins I pulled first go around. Um, the other album pulls were Hey Chan, Twice, Mark, and Chenla. And since I don't collect them, they are now in my binder that I keep for selling and trading. But we'll keep these two here because we have another Jamin. And this is Hey Chan. Wow, I've been getting Hey Chan blessed with this album too. And I'm so glad he's a popular member because 
I will be able to trade him off for some Geno and Jamins. Here's the green one again. This is the one that I accidentally like stabbed poor Ren June's head trying to cut it open with my blade. So we'll be a little more careful this time. All right. Mini poster is Hey Chan. I think from the shirt this is Hey Chan. Hey Chan is obsessed with me too. My goodness. And we got let's reverse the order. Ji Sung. Cute. And Oh, another dupe. It's another Jamin. That's okay. That's okay. I am very, very happy with my pulls. Let me get organized and I'll be right back. And we are back. This is what I got in my second set of NCT Dream's first full length album, Hot Sauce, from K Town for You. I am overall very, very happy with my pulls. This again was the best pull. Two Genos. I mean, like, what? And then a couple of dupes, but, you know, got another Jamin and Hei Chan and Ji Sung. So, like I said, happy, happy, happy. This will be an insert clip. I'll add it to the end of my very depressing other one. And um, hopefully it'll be uploaded in a reasonable time. Back to regularly scheduled programming. Bye. But okay, let me stop rambling. Um, I actually have a second set of these albums also on the way. I'm not quite sure why they didn't ship together from K-Town for you. So maybe I'll get luckier and get some Geno on the second set of albums. La, 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 la. And stay tuned because I do have uh, future unboxings. I know I pre-ordered TXT's latest comeback. Um, I also pre-ordered 17's latest comeback. And I've also pre-ordered EXO, ah, their latest comeback, and I've got a Neo Kyo haul uh, arriving any day now. So stay on the lookout for those future videos. And as always, thank you for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, that'd be awesome. Um, leave me any helpful advice. And as always, stay safe, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye. Ooh, more bonus content, because I just love to spoil y'all. This also came in the mail today from some sellers on Mercari, and since I like to write fast so they get paid, let's open these up together as well. Okay, this first one is from California. Mingyu, as you may or may not know, I have decided that I am collecting Mingu and Wanwu, or Wanu, from Seventeen. They are pretty much the last set of biases I'm going to collect because I collect way too many and it's wrecking my finances. So I had aspirations of also collecting Jackson from GOT7 or formerly GOT7 and WoW from Ace and Lido from One Us, and Wyatt from On and Off, and Subin from TXT, but I just, I just can't. I have too many going on already, and I still have not completed my ultimate bias sets, including like Kyung Su, who was my very first one. So my cutoff is Mingyu and Wanu, Wanwu, because I just love these two. This is from, I believe, their incomplete concert set. I hopefully am correct on that one. This is number 24. And it looks like we got some freebies. Oh, we got some 17 group action. Got a cute Mingyu, like, Lomo card. Oh, and a very cute Mingyu photograph. And some stickers. Cute, cute, cute. All right. Thank you, Enna. I will be sure to give you a good rating. 
and last one. And this one comes to us from Nevada. Oh, it's Wanu, Wanwu. I don't know, I see it pronounced Wanu and Wanwu. But this is from an ode. Wait, I was com confused. Oh, you, is there more? There's more than one. Oh, Mingu. Oh, <laughs> there's another Wanu. Oh, nice. All right, so we got two Wanus, Wanwus. Well, y'all, let me know what's the correct pronunciation. I see Wanwu and I see Wanu, but this is from an ode. We got the real and truth versions. And Mingyu looks like you made my dawn eternal sunshine version. And guys, are you excited for the Mingyu and Wanu collaborative single that's coming out on the 28th with Lehigh? Like, my meanie heart is exploding. I'm so excited. The teaser clips are Chef's Kiss. Wow. That's so awesome. No note in this one. Oh, maybe there is. Oh, there is a note. With, oh, group freebie. And a sticker. Thank you, Kyong Hase on Mercari. That's their information. And then you shall get a good rating as well. Okay. That's the last clip for real. Bye bye.